I had to build a custom shower tray for this bathroom, so I cut the first three quarters of an inch of the perimeter off the tray. I'll explain why in a moment. Then I cut another four and three quarters off each side to cut this down to the size that I needed. I then used a five inch hole saw to create a hole for my drain in the floor that was centered on the shower valve. I dampened the subfloor, applied my thin set first with the flat side, then the notch side. When I add back those three quarter inch pieces, they're actually flat, and that allows me to get a flat perimeter with my floor tile as well as my wall tile. So I hope these tips help you out.